I'm going to show you how to get the SNES 9X GX channel on your Wii U menu. All you need for this tutorial is your homebrewed Wii U with SNES 9X GX setup, and you'll need WAP Installer GX2, which if you used my uh, homebrew Wii U video, you'll already have that. And you'll also need an extraction software to extract the RAR files we're going to download. But that's it, so let's get right into it. So if you go to the link in the description, it'll take you to this Google Drive page. Uh, just in the top right, click download, and it should download in the bottom left of your computer. And then we're going to open up the SD card that we use to mod our Wii U. So when, you, when you're on your SD card, open up that downloaded file, go into the folder, and notice there's a readme text. Uh, if you want to learn more about the channel and what it does, you can read up on it, but you don't need it, so we're not going to bother with it. So on the root of your SD card, if you don't already have an install folder like me, just right click, create a new folder, and call it install. I already have one, so it's not letting me make a new one. But we're gonna just drag this file, snex9xgx, into the install folder. And then once it's in there, you should be able to open it up and see that file. If you open this file, it should look like this. That's what we want. So that's basically it on the computer. Uh, so I'll meet you over on the Wii U. And once you're over on your Wii U, make sure you're running your custom firmware. I'm using Tiramisu, so I'm gonna go into the Mii Maker, which is the homebrew launcher. And once your apps load, we're gonna find WUP Installer GX2 right here. Click on it, load it up. And from here, it has to be done on the gamepad, so I will meet you on there. So we're in WUP Installer GX2. We're gonna look for the file we downloaded, which is right here, SNEX9X. Just click on it, click install, click yes. And here you can install it to your NAND or your USB drive. Now this is very small, so I'm just gonna do it to my NAND, which is your internal Wii U storage. So click on it, and it should begin the process. So it'll bring up the Wii U menu, but this is still, it's starting the download, so don't worry about that. See, we're back and it's installing. Should be pretty quick. And we're done. So successfully installed, we're good to go, so press OK. And it'll just do its reloading thing. And we're once, once we're back on this screen, we're just gonna click the home, bro, oh, the home channel, home button, oops, wow. <laughs> and we're gonna go back to the Wii, Wii U menu and check out our new channel, I'll meet you there. And as you can see, we have SNEX 9X GX. So let's just start it up and test it out. And as you can see, this software also supports the Wii U gamepad, so if you wanna use it, just click yes. If not, just click no, I'm just gonna click yes. So this process saves a lot of time because you don't have to go to the virtual Wii and you don't have to go into the homebrew channel after that. And then it should load up straight into, look at that, that was pretty quick actually. So now you can play your games straight from your Wii U menu. Let's start one up and test it out. And right now I'm using the gamepad to select and you can even see it on your gamepad which is pretty cool. But anyways, that's it for the video. Uh, if you if you found this helpful, make sure to like and subscribe. And if you found it really helpful, you can uh, support me by clicking on the super thanks and donating. But anyways, I hope you enjoy your new SNES channel on your Wii U menu. And I look forward to seeing you on the next tutorial video. Have a happy new year and I'll see you on the next video. Take care.